So if I'm working on a Chromebook or I can't get Eclipse to work for some reason, I can use this website called Replit to write some Java code. So I'm going to go and find it. I'm going to make a new one. I'm going to choose Java as my language and create it. Now, I already have an account on here and I'm logged in, so you see my name there. When I set this uh, workspace up, you see it gives me a file main.java. It gives it this class main puts a main function inside there, prints hello world. Um, if I want to run, I can hit this play button. And it takes a moment, it's a little bit slow. It's okay. And it should print hello world over here once it gets uh, itself together here. There we go, hello world. Um, now what if I want to have an additional file or whatever. Well, I'm, I'm stuck having this guy. I have to keep this file and it has to be called that. But if I want to make another file with a different class in it, I can over here. I can make folders like this um, to make a new file. Click add file. Here I can call this something else, but I'll make the extension .java, so it's a Java file. Now the class name that I choose should match this file name exactly. So this is class example. And I can put my own main method in here. And I can put whatever I want in here. Now, once I've got this typed in, I can try to run it. And what it's going to do is you'll see over here that it's it's writing example and it's writing main. But what comes out on the console is going to be when this thing finally finishes working. Hello world, which is not what I've written right here, right? That's what's back in, in main. Um, but it has worked with my file to get my file to run. Just click in the console and I'll write the word Java and I'll write the name of my class. And then it will do the code that I have inside of here. 